Hi guys! So, first thing you may notice today is I've dyed my hair again. I wanted to go for something like completely different than what I've ever had before. Um, I've had this colour in my hair before but I've never had a full head of blue. <laughs> so, yeah. It's kind of nice because in some light it looks black but then in other light it looks blue. I was scared that on camera it was going to look black. But yeah, I can see the blue. So, that's my new hair. It is um, turquoise by directions if anybody's going to ask. So, that's that. Um, where do I start? It's a haul video again. I haven't done like a proper video in a while. Um, remember to enter my competition. Um, one thing I did forget to mention is if you enter more than once, you're going to be um, excluded from it because I don't think it's fair if people keep posting their entry loads of times so one entry per person if you enter more than once you're disqualified so keep that in mind um, so yeah whole video so in Superdrug I had an offer on Barry M where um, you can get a glossy tube um, or a nail paint mix and match sort of thing for 4.99 so I got this glossy tube which is number four it's a very very pretty baby pink colour it's not got any shimmer in it as well, which I do sort of like. I'm wearing it on my lips now. And it is really nice. And I got one of the nail paints in pink iridescent. And this is 264. And I can't believe that I don't own this one yet. But it is like a beautiful baby pink with blue, green, pink, silver sparkles in it. It's gorgeous. That'll be an amazing like top coat. So I got those from Superdrug. I also picked up this from Superdrug as well, which is the Sammy. They used to have these on, I think it was either Ideal World or QVC, and their products are quite good. Uh, this is called Freeze Style. It gives 24 hour hold, ultra shine, anti-frizz, anti-static, and it's got a UV filter in it as well. If you've got dyed hair, UV filter is very, very good. So this was 2 99 I don't know how much it was before, but it was on offer. So, got that. Um, I'm going to do this in a completely weird order. I'm just going to pick stuff up as I come to it. I made a Yours Clothing order. I only ordered two things, but I ended up with three things somehow. So, I ordered a belt um, because it was in the sale and I fell in love with it. And they ended up sending me two. I'm not complaining. <laughs> so these are £5 and I only paid for one. But they're this... Like they've got gems on them and stuff and then got this glittery leopard print. Glitter and leopard print is amazing for me. It's got these other gems on it as well. So yeah. I've got those two for five pounds. So that is a bargain if you ask me. Um also from yours clothing, I'll show you this one next. I haven't tried this on yet, so I don't know how it's gonna look. It could go one of two ways. Um but it's just this, it's called a baby doll top and it's like, it's a funny design at the bottom, it's like up and down and I don't know how I can show you, <laughs> it's a bit weird but yeah, I like this design, there's somebody at the door, I hear Penny barking, so that's the front design, I really like it, it is a little bit um, gathered underneath the bust, so yeah, that was £9. I think it was like supposed to be 18 or something like that. Um, and it is a beautiful material as well. It's silk, silky sort of stuff. It's not actual silk. But yeah, I'm going to try that on and hope that it looks good. I have a, um, a thing of thinking, finding that yours clothing isn't... It can go on both, one of two ways again. It can either fit you okay or it can be massive. Like even if you ordered the proper size, it can be massive. That's the way that I always find yours clothing. On to Evans, which I went to today. And I fell in love with this as soon as I saw it. Um, it is a cardigan sort of material. And it's three quarter length sleeves. But it's got a zip up the front. And it's got pockets and everything. And it's got a hood. And I like the colour of this as well. It's like a... 
I don't know how to describe it. It's not black, it's not blue, it's not grey, it's not brown. It's a mix of all that. And this was supposed to be £35, but obviously um, I still have my discount card. So I got 40% off that. So I love that to bits. It looks so nice on. It's gorgeous. Love it. Then from their sale, I got this for £20. And it's this top. Again, it's a floaty, beautiful, absolutely gorgeous top. I got 40% off this one as well, so it's a bargain. It's also got a top underneath it as well. So that it's not like totally see-through, because you can see through it. But yeah, looks gorgeous on. It's a really nice length, and it's very floaty, and the material's beautiful as well. Love it. Um, I got a couple of magazines from WH Smiths. <laughs> Yeah, I got the One Direction Top of the Pop special. <laughs> and uh, I also traded stuff in to get a 3DS today. But that's downstairs, I didn't bring that upstairs. Um, but yeah, I like trading stuff in because it means that you get uh, you can get a 3DS for like 20 quid. That's what I ended up paying for my 3DS. So I'm pleased with that. So yeah, this is the One Direction Top of the Pop special. Um, it's just got loads of stuff about One Direction in it. You know the deal, it's got posters, I'm not going to use the posters, but yeah, it's a nice thing to have if you're a One Direction fan. And then I got Neo Magazine as well. I really, really like this magazine because uh, it's all about manga, anime, um, basically just Japanese culture and stuff like that. Talking about music and all that the good stuff. And uh, it's just really, really good. Keeps you up to date with what's happening in Japan, even if you're not in Japan. So, love that. Uh, from the pound shop, um, I got this Winnie the Pooh um, little notebook. And they sell these in the works, but I think that they're more expensive than a pound. And it's got this little tie thing on. And that's the design inside. It's cute. And then you just pull it back over. Like that. So it's something nice to just keep in your bag if you need a little notebook. And I also got this ER one, which is a folder. I did get some folder sheets to put like bank statements and stuff in there. Um, so yeah, that was a pound, three pound each. I think that that's quite a bargain because I'm sure that they're more expensive in the works. Um, and then from, where did I get these from? Peacocks. I got two bags. I was going to get one bag that was like £12.50, but then I ended up getting these two bags for £9, like for both of them, so I thought that was a bargain. Uh, I've got this one, again these are from Peacocks, it's just a nice little polka dot bag. Uh, these straps are like faux leather, but they're absolutely gorgeous. Inside, it's bright yellow, it's got a zip and everything, and a place to put your phone on this side. Um, and yeah, how much was this supposed to be? When it first came in, this was £12, and it got reduced to 6 and then it was 4 So, £4 if you fancy a really, really cute polka dot bag in Peacocks. And then this one, this was the only one that they had left of these, and I love it. It's like a proper sort of grungy style, I'd say. It's very relaxed, and it's made of wool, so I think it's a good, like, winter time bag, which is what I'm going to be using it for. Uh, it's got this like heart thing on it, which is really pretty. Uh, it's only got one strap, but it's a massive like thick strap, so this isn't gonna like fall off your shoulder or anything like that. Um, inside, it's got a clasp like that. It is absolutely massive inside. I can't put into words how big it is. You could put everything in here. Uh, it's got a place for your phone, and then a zippy thing there as well. And this was five pounds. I don't know how much this one was supposed to be. Sticker stuck over it. Let me have a look. No, oh. <laughs> I've just ripped the sticker off. So I don't know how much this one was to start with, but I absolutely love it. And yeah, I think that's it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go now. Um, I have got another thing, 
But I don't know if I, I'm going to show it because I don't know how many people are interested in The Simpsons. <laughs> if you're interested in The Simpsons and want to see a video about something I bought to do with The Simpsons, leave a comment below. And yeah, that is it. I'm going to get off now and upload this and I'm going to relax for the rest of the day and I am then going to watch Show Me The Funny, the final tonight. If Pat doesn't win that, there's something desperately wrong with the UK <laughs> and the people who are voting on that show. God, it's so... The sun is in my eyes at the minute. It's really, really bright. Um, yeah, if Pat doesn't win that, there's something wrong because he's the only one that I think is naturally funny. Like, he can get laughs out of people just by fannying about in the crowd. <laughs> Which I just think is, it, every time I go to see a comedian, if they interact with the audience, I always find that I enjoy it more. And that's just what Pat does. And he's amazing. Pat to win. So if you watch it, vote for Pat. Um, and yeah, that's about it. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all again very soon. Adios!